Hello, welcome back to more new mystery of the emblem. We now finally made it to the Ice Dragon Shrine, the frozen land. We go from fire map to ice map. This was truly a journey beyond all imagination. 5,000 meters, no, perhaps even higher than that. The clouds already below them, they ascend the frozen mountain. Suffocation, vertigo. They were already approaching the limits of their strengths. I don't know what vertigo is. Well, is everyone making good at the drill grounds? If you win often, you'll be much stronger. And have I been going? No, I haven't gone there. No, I don't need to. I don't really have the money. Oh, please, I don't even need the drill grounds. I mean, look at me. I'm a level 8 berserker. But, fine, whatever. Alright. So, thanks to the heroic people of Altier who stood up to protect the princess, the people of Archania came to know that she was alive and resumed their battle against Dor. The Liberation Army was led by Duke Cortes, who fought with the royal shield given to him by Artemis. And thanks to the efforts of tides, the battle turned to the favor. However, the king of the Earth Dragons, Medius, had finally decided to make his move. Yep, the main villain of the previous game and of this game, obviously. Before his overwhelming might, it seemed Altier's resistance wouldn't last any longer. But then a stage appeared before them. It spoke of a divine sword enshrined in the ice shrine of the distant north. With that blade, it would be impossible to fell Medius. But the way to obtain it would be isn't isn't easy. And that's what we're doing. We passed the Desert of Death and the Fire Dragon's Graveyard. The last of the Henri's way leads to the Ice Dragon Shrine. If we obtain the Light Sphere, we can combat the Dark Sphere, blah blah blah, you get the idea. And we made peace with Sir Sirius. It looks like you're maintaining your weapons. That's right, my weapon once broke during a mission. I have been very vigilant ever since. Yep, even even the most professional of fighters can make simplest mistakes. It happens to everybody. The main problem was there was too many enemies. If my mighty lance were to break, it'd be all over. You could just punch them. There's another reason. I can't risk a surprise attack from a knight overzealous in his devotion of age. Wait, there's somebody here. Cool, what's that? Oh, a blocked attack. What happened? His assailant has fled. If you didn't help me, I would be there. Oh, his mask fell down. Oh. Well, we already know he was, so really, no surprise. Oh, Aster, it seems to be even behaving oddly since the other day. Don't tell me you're hiding something from us. Okay, I'm terrible at making pledges in front of people. How about this? You make a pledge inside your heart and protect my smarts from the shadows together with me. Alright, then training together enemies. Starting tomorrow, you're training with me. We'll make wake up before dawn, then first we'll run ten laps around the base, followed by a thousand sword swings. Oh, come on. What was that, Caster? You're gone. <laughs> yep. Caster, you really dug yourself into a grave. And then Malaysia starts hitting on us. Say it again! You do training every single day. How can you train your, by yourself when you're such a cute girl by your side? Yeah, you'll lose your competitive edge, huh? So boring. Okay, we'll see you dance. Invigorate people. A special dance, eh? What is. Oh god, she's gonna do a lap dance, isn't it? Is this a lap dance? It's very revealing. Oh dear god, it is. What? Especially though. Oh my god, is she hitting on us? She really is hitting on us. Oh! Okay! Oh, that's what it was, huh? You freaking tease! Tease me back, huh? I'm going back to training, fuck this. Yeah, he, he done. Well, oh, there it. Lost in thought, are you? Nothing of the sort. When I close my eyes like this and feel the wind in my body, my heart becomes free and I can focus. Yeah, he is the wind mage after all. Thanks to the wind magic Excalibur. Not Rexcalibur, which is kind of weaker, which is different weapon. Excalibur is actually more of a legendary weapon. It wasn't because he was better at Elrain, but it was because of the magic's personality. That's why he got the Excalibur Tome. Some magic tomes have a will of their own and the magic chooses its owner. Even though it's such an advanced tome, Merrick can use it at such a low level. 
If things were different, maybe Elorain could have done it. But, you got Thoron, which is a good tome. Speaking of Thoron, he won't be needing that, so you know what? Hand it over. Yeah, give me the Thoron, you're not gonna need it. Oh yes, and now, this is the most important thing. We gotta count, we gotta see if we have all 12 Star Special. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, um, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I need all, I need, please tell me I have them all, I need them all, otherwise it's over, I cannot win. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, eleven. Please tell me I'm not missing a to- Please tell me I'm not missing a shard. Okay, okay, there it is. Oh, thank God. Okay. Woo. Yeah, I'm so glad I'm not missing a shard. If I was, I'd have to. I literally this then this LP is literally over. I cannot could proceed. I'd have to start all over. But I'm not missing a tome. I'm not missing a shot. We have them all. So therefore, we can continue on normally. Yeah, I should give this to someone who can actually use magic, effectively. Like Merrick. Or maybe Malaysia. No, wait. Wow, Malaysia actually has more magic than Merrick. As a surprise. Okay. Oh yeah, let's not see how everyone's doing today. That was some serious training! I think I did real good, considering me lack of willpower. 23 XP. Well, they're well. Ooh, skill and resistance. Eh, not bad. Eh, Bantu, who cares? That's it. Okay. It has come to my attention that we have a lot of, um, Master Seals. Considering the fact that almost everybody is pretty much promoted, with the exception of Katria, I might as well go ahead and sell them all at this point. I mean, really, I'm not going to need them. Okay, let's go ahead and get some weapons. Some well-needed weaponry. Okay, hold on. Yeah, fuck it, let's just... No, 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 I gotta be prepared for this. I cannot afford any slip-ups. Yes, so... Okay, you know what? Do I have any money? Uh, let's see. Alright. Let's see if we can get some weapon level up for Julian. Okay, A2... Nope, that's not winnable. 7, 15... Yeah, okay, let's go for it. Yeah, you just keep doing your thing, Julian. You're good. You're good just the way you are. A level up is just what we needed. Yep, and again, he has absurdly high strength growth. And we got the weapon level up, just what we needed. Alright, I'm done here. State save. And now, why don't we just go ahead and upgrade to a steel sword. There. Yeah. For a thief, he's actually pretty strong. Considering the fact that thieves don't actually promote this game. No, we don't get assassins. Alright, let's go. Are we there yet, Zane? We've climbed so high already. It's freezing, it's become increasingly difficult to breathe. I'll amount Everest. Just hang on, Princey. Look, can you see it? There's the ice dragon shrine over there. Lord Godo is waiting for you. You know, I have to admit, when I was shocked when you told me that Tiki was the daughter of the Divine Dragon King, and that you and Godo were both Divine Dragons. Well, you see, after the war, Godo and I threw away our dragon stones, so I can never be a dragon again. Sure, Godo still stands by Naga's command and watches after humans, but me? I don't really like humans. I got nothing but contempt for those who treated the defenseless mannequins like insects. Yeah, Zane would definitely be a white fang material. Medius from the Earth Dragon was the only one of the Earth tribe who actually became a mannequin. Every other other dragon decided they didn't want to be human. This is like, nope, we're gonna be beasts and kill everybody. They posed the dragons who had done nothing wrong. Furious at the betrayal by humans, the Manichaeans gathered at Dole, and they created a nation for the people. They fought to conquer humanity. 
and to save the dragons, Koro gave him the, the Falchia. He established an academy in Kaiden and began to teach magic. Me, I was just an onlooker. We're not a loser. Who the hell cares? I mean, he helped us because he seemed kind of flaky. I didn't want you alone. Um, thank you? Oh, bless it. Let's head to the Dragon Shrine. But watch out for the Ice Dragons. Even though they lost their minds, they still protect the Shrine instinctively. Those poor creatures. So yes, now we have Ice Dragons. They're not as powerful as the Wyverns and... They're not as strong as the Fire Dragons, but they still hurt, actually. Not to mention, considering the fact that there's rivers here, these guys can actually cross water. Because it makes sense, because ice is water, it's just frozen water. Also, more fucking weapons. And even more, what else? Beck! Another ballistician who was in the previous game, absent from Shadow Drake, absent from the original Mystery of the Emblem. Now he's no longer a ballistician, but instead, now he's a horseman. Also, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if this was in the original game, but was Fire Magic actually strong against Ice Dragons? I mean, it's probably why Bantu was actually uh, useful in that game. I mean, let's think about it. I mean, think about it. You know, fire melts ice. These guys, are, these ice dragons are still intact despite fire magic. Oh, and also reinforcements will spawn once you cross, like, the most center, most area. Yep, ice dragons. They may not be as powerful as the other dragon. They're actually kind of more the defensive type. They still hurt, though. They still really, really hurt. Also, now we have Dark Mages. Absent in the enemy, absent in the original game. Well, no, they weren't absent in the original game. They were there, but we never saw enemy Dark Mages. Because the enemy variety was just so limited. So I'm glad they have, this is why I'm glad the enemy variety is all over the place here. I mean, we have to fight so many paladins, horse riders, generals, draco knights, ballisticians, curate. It just kind of got old real fast. Oh, hello, oh yeah. Oh yeah, I have a silence death. I have a thief spell, too. Well, I might as well use it. Uh, make you count. I choose you. Spirit dust. More magic. And the thief spell broke. Unfortunately. Yeah, fuck it. Good crit. Thank you, Merrick. Thank you, Merrick Ishtar. There is a unit named Ishtar in Genealogy of the Holy War. And for some reason, she kind of looks like Weiss. I mean, look at her. Look up the character Ishtar and fire him. Doesn't she look like Weiss Schnee from Ruby? I'm pretty sure she does. Oh, a guy in her own personal... And the whole clear only has one use left. I've been wasting it too much. Uh, let's see. Steel Ants, go! Don't let me down. Thank you, Sita. You are... You are... You are a great gal to have, and a great princess, and a great bride to mark. Again, like I said. Okay, might as well conserve the magic. Well, actually, it doesn't really matter. The Hulk player is about to waste its use anyways. Also, I need money. Hey, Marth, if you'd like to get a crit, that'd be great. Oh god, it's a silver axe! That's scary. Um, wait. Um, 13? Okay. Okay, wait. Um, let's not go and attack. This could be dangerous. We still have barbarians. Yeah, maybe I should have put Marth on the other side and go there. Yeah. Oh dear. Damn. What? 
You know, I really missed it when I was able to double enemies. Like normal. Yeah, now you've done it. Now you're gonna get cut into the mat grass with your blood. Now your blood will stain the snow. I'm getting elements mixed up. Shit. Yeah, these enemies. Why are the enemies so fast that I can no longer double them? Oh, he went for Castor. I thought for sure he went for Sida, who's like pretty much low on health. Oh god, here come the wyverns. Damn these stupid wyverns. Well, whatever. I got past the first turn this time, so now I can I can at least I can at least breathe easier today. Well, this turn I can. Alright, how far are they? Okay, so maybe not too far. We, we can at least catch up later on. You have one more- You have one more use of the killer bow. Can you get a crit? That would really help you. Also, this guy has 11 sword. Okay. Well, good use of the killer bow. Yeah, it makes it a little better. That's a little better. And these enemies do not play around. My god. Oh, shoot. One more level up. Alright, cool. I do like snow levels here. It's great that these levels don't actually... Like, it's great that the snow doesn't actually impair the movement speed. Unlike, I think, another game. Oh yeah, Blazing Sword. How come when it snowed, like whenever rain or snow falls, you had to, your movement was reduced. That made no sense. I really didn't get that. That was a dumb design. I mean, other games had rain, and other maps in other games had rain, and they were fine. So why here? This makes no sense. All right, Julian, use Steel Sword. Nice shot, it's super effective. Wait, this ain't Pokemon. Alright, bring out the wyverns. I can take them. I'm gonna have to take them. I don't really have a choice. Alright. Maybe I should give Mer I should have probably given Merrick a staff. Because he can heal too. Not sure why his base magic is surprisingly low. But weird. That's weird. I fucked myself! I certainly fucked myself. I did not think this through. I am going to die again, aren't I? Dodge? Why? Why is it always enough just to kill? That makes no sense. It's, this game is just trolling me. Okay, so by my calculation, Siri should be able to take two hits from these guys. Okay, so that's one. That guy did 17 on Sirius, so it's always Wyvern number two. Yeah, I calculated. But my god, these guys hurt! Okay, no crit this time, huh? That's okay. Alright. Now, gotta stick to st strategically. Gotta think this through from an ecological standpoint. Or something like that. Measure the measure the diameter and distance of the moves. Only then will we proceed with our goal. I'm just, if I talk smart, it looks like I know what I'm doing. It doesn't. Well, okay then. Plan B. Wow, okay. That makes up for it. Is that enough for the steel sword? No, it's not. Hmm, I could have let Melissa attack, but she's not in range. Well, just stick to healing. That's all we can hope up for at this point. Well, I guess I'll have to use the Rim Slayer. Kind of a waste, but whatever. What can you do? Alright, another level up. Woo! Beautiful! I refuse to lose this one, so I'm going to save two, so I can preserve it. 
Because every time I get a good level up, it's always taken away from me. By magical, by unwanted, unwanted fails. Because I don't know what I'm doing at the time. Okay, you know what? Let's have Julian just go and steal things. He's a thief, that's what he's good for, after all. Dragon Pike, this will come in handy. This will definitely come in handy. And I guess I'll give the kill to Minerva. Since, you know, she could definitely use it. I mean, no, she doesn't need it. She's okay, but like, it helps. Everything helps. And these dragons are chock full of speed. Oh, I really wish I gave Merrick another staff. Alright. Reinforcements don't spawn until, again. They don't spawn until you cross this area right here. They all come from the forts. There are forts here. Yep, there's one, there's some right there. Anywho, let's go ahead and have a little chat with Beck. Uh, assuming he doesn't go ahead and actually hit me. Would really suck if he hit me, but you know what, I don't think he has uh, any reason to attack me. He's not he's not even a bad man. Again, Beck was also another ballistician Shadow Dragon. But since he wasn't in the original mystery of the emblem, they had to reclass him had to, when they brought him back, they had to reclass him as a as a horseman, I guess. Why can't we have ballisticians? I mean, I know they're bad. I know they're not the best class, but goddamn, they really, really would come in handy. Especially since you know, having long-range attackers is really, really useful. Okay, you know what? These guys are gonna have to cross the bridges over there. If you don't, if you can't fly across water, take the long way. Take the scenic route. It's much nicer. Okay, moving on. Not moving on. Oh god, I didn't expect these guys to move. This is a problem. Alright, fuck it. Plan B. Just lower them over here. Beck! How you doing, buddy? It's been a long time. You'd think we'd meet you here of all places. Me too, but not. Oh, I might to see you. It's been far too long. After the war, I was traveling the continent, and uh, somehow you landed up here. Well, glad you're here. You wouldn't have joined these guys. We're fighting another war. Come with us, why don't you? I don't have my ballast here anymore. Just my horsey buddy right here. But if you're fine with that, then sure. I'll help you, Princey. Yeah. Beck was actually one of my favorite ballasticians in Shadow Dragon. Again, I know it's because there are only- I know even though there are only two uni two ballisticians in that game, Beck was obviously the better of the two. It also helped that he came that he came equipped with a Thunderbolt, which was super effective against ballisticians, in a map that contained pretty much only ballistician enemies. So we could level up really easily and be really good. Alright, I think these two- I think these two flying ladies can cross the water. Yep, no danger over here, so it's safe to it's safe to go. You're in the clear. Oh yes, there's also another secret shop. Unfortunately, we're passing it because I have no money whatsoever. I'm I'm broke. I'm completely broke of gold. All right, these guys. Alright, come here. Okay, that guy decided to go the opposite way. Okay. Now then, wait, these guys can't cross water. Nope, they can only cross, they're good at crossing mountains. Not water though, thankfully. But these guys, okay, these, these guys are scary. Get a crit! No, no crit. What if I try this? Let's try this. All right. Let's try this again, shall we? Here, I'll just take the hit. I'll divert my attention so you don't die. Go.
go! Long range attack! Attack! Oh yeah, nice shot! Oh no! Okay, wait, I think I fucked myself in again. Okay, just one chance. If this guy could dodge an attack, it'd be great. If you can dodge a, if you can dodge an X, you can dodge a ball. That's the first rule of dodgeball. Dodge something! Oh, the water's frozen too! I like even the river's frozen in this battle in the battle background. It's a nice touch, I like it. Okay, please dodge. Please? 